chosen to do the review of this car in the dark because I haven't collected any Jettas for sale for a very long time and I was so impressed with this one I wanted to try my best to capture it on video. I've driven this 45 miles now and I tell you what out of all the VWs this is turning out to be one of the better ones simply because I can't find anything wrong with the car There's 60 miles an hour there, obviously this is not a fast car, but that's not why I'm doing the review. The reason why I'm doing this review is because everything on this car, apart from one thing, is absolutely perfect. And I'll start with what I find wrong with it. What I find wrong with it is this little bit undersized engine. It's a common thing with, with smaller car engine cars, but if this car had a bigger engine, it would be perfect. It's the drive of this vehicle, there's nothing wrong with it, it's effortless. The gear change, 5 speed gear change, maybe a 6 gears would be nice. The steering is perfect, the illumination is perfect, the dashboard, the console, the way it's laid out couldn't be more simpler or elementary. It's just there, bang, all the buttons there you want to be able to look at, get to where you want to be, and be done with it and move on without taking your time off the road for any more time than you need to. The wing mirrors are good, visibility is fantastic, the rear view vision, apart from a slight obstruction by the headrests, it's fine. I can't find anything about this car which is um, worthy of me invalidating it. Okay, that maybe there are some, some slight silly little things like it, maybe a little bit of cheap tacky sort of dashboard, and uh, the lack of the sixth gear is noticeable, especially on a smaller engine vehicle and it does come across as basic, but the value you get for your money with this car is second to none. And if I sat down for an hour, I'd be hard pressed to find a car within the same bracket, price bracket, where you could get just as much value for money. This car is seamless. You know, it's not designed to be um, a luxurious, top-end car, but for where it's supposed to be, it does exactly what it says on the tin, and if you're looking at buying a car at that level, at that strata, you're not going to get better than this. And secondly, being VW, German, I think you're going to get yourself a very reliable vehicle. Anybody watching these videos for about the VW Jetta won't be watching it because they belong to any fan club or something, they'll be watching it because they're thinking about buying one. Take one for a test drive, and you will see exactly what I mean. What I would suggest, though, is try and go for something with a bigger engine. When you have a smaller engine in a vehicle, they do seem to struggle.